Park. What do you think so far? As for me, I'm really happy for Shell. <laughs> she was always in a rush to learn about things, but never gave herself much thought. <gasps> what if this is her mom? Oh, it looks like she's changed all for the better. But is that the same for her companion? Before we get to that, there's still the trip to the Vrion Kingdom. The next part is one of my favorites. Shell meets someone special there. A certain someone similar to Shell herself, watching over Vierne from a tower. Huh? The pages for the Vierne Kingdom are missing. It looks like someone didn't write them yet. Oh my, it looks like we'll have to skip the part for, with Vierne for now. I mean, I know the story, but... I didn't practice telling it yet. I thought the pages would be here. I'm sorry, please don't be mad. Wait, what? I'm confused. Help me. Maybe if one day people wish for it, you'll be able to meet him. <gasps> Wait a minute. Something lights up the book. The Viren Kingdom stories are glowing. Wow, it looks like they're done after all. I'm sorry I made you worry, and thank you for your patience. What the fuck was this about? Okay. Alright. I'll roll with it. Now then, let's get right to it. And so, after some time... <coughs> one day, you reach the Vyern Kingdom. Huh? What, what are you so worried about, Florin? It looks like a normal town. I don't know about that. I've heard rumors once in a while about Vyern. That I hope I'm pronouncing properly. <laughs> They're usually about Vyern's royal family, and they aren't nice rumors. Really? Like what? Well, the most prominent one is that one day, something was wrong inside the mansion. That night, people outside heard screams coming from the halls of it. But after that, no one left or entered the mansion, and the gates shut on their own. Anyone who tries to get into the mansion nowadays just can't. Huh. That kind of makes me want to try to get in the mansion. I mean, a little bit. <sighs> please. Please don't say that you want to go into the mansion. <laughs> nah! <laughs> of course not. Don't be silly. That's not me. Why would I want to go into the mansion that no one can get into? It might be dangerous. And stuff. No, 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 okay. Uh-huh. In any case, there are worse rumors about Vyrne, but perhaps they simply resulted from the first? The, perhaps, this, do you agree, did this, did that? Ah. I'm, I pardon, beg pardons. Okay, mm. Perhaps the disagreeable reputation made from the rumors unfairly passed off to the entire kingdom. Yeah, I, hopefully, I hope. Do you need like a drink of water or a breath mint or something? Do you think the rumors about Vierna are true? Huh. Coming from someone who is the center of multiple rumors. Oh, right, Plaid died here, that's right. Mm. I doubt the valid valid <laughs> Can I have that breath mint now please? Please can I have thank you. Okay. Hmm. <clears throat> <sighs> oh, okay. I doubt the validity of most rumors. But even so, something must have caused the rumors to arise in the first place. And we can only hope that it is all less than its reputation is. Yeah, 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 that. Maybe we should ask some residents about it first. In that case, follow me. Just as a precaution. Oh, right, yeah, okay. With that, Florence started talking to a girl who was standing nearby. Excuse me! Not in this lifetime, pretty boy! What? What? Huh? Um... 
Excuse me? Sorry, but I don't want to be seen talking to other guys. Ugh. I'm in a very, see, it's very serious, please notice me relationship. <laughs> of course, with Ayas. Uh, please notice me relationship. That does not make any sense, madam. What are you talking about? God, you must not know who Ayas is. I, I don't, so, um, I'm probably going to regret asking this, but, uh, who's... Wait! Shut up! Uh, uh, uh? Poor Florin. He's walking this way! Oh my gosh. Look at that. <laughs> A man with long blue hair comes walking down the street. The girl you were with fainted. As eyes passed by, he noticed the fainted girl. Oh, oh shit, I don't have a voice for this. No! <laughs> the ultimate undoing. Okay. Oh, I must have another voice here somewhere. Um. Ugh. Ugh. <sighs> um. Ah, uh, is she okay? Ah, now that you've noticed her, yeah, she's top shelf. Hmm, <laughs> if you say so. You let the girl rest in peace on a nearby bench. What happened to her? I, I, don't, I don't know if I'm doing this right, but it's... Uh, it's <clears throat> <clears throat> what happened to her? She fainted, she fainted once you came into a ten-foot radius of her. Oh. Of course. My apologies for that not being the first thing that came to mind. Oh, uh, don't worry about it at all. <laughs> so you don't know this girl at all? Not personally, but I've seen her in my audience sometimes. Audience? Yes, it's... Oh. Wait a second. Huh? Miss, it looks like you... I I just reaches to the side of your hair and pulls out a flower from behind your ear. He's a fucking street magician. <laughs> magician. Had something in your hair. <laughs> wow, was that magic? Question mark? A magic trick, to be more precise. Magic, but not in the normal sense. Here you go, then. Ice gives you the flower. Thank you, that was amazing. Check that really anyone could have done. Not at all. It's easy when I have such a spectacular audience, such as yourself. Mm. <coughs> Oh, did you want a flower too? No. No thank you. No fucking thank you. Please don't. If you say so. You three are new to Vern, right? I don't think I've seen you before. Are you adventurers? Yes. Yes, we are. That is who we are. We came here because I was curious about what Vern was like. Oh, really? I don't hear that every day. Oh, shit. Am I using the sexy nurse voice for him? Fuck! Ah! Oh, ah. Uh. Okay, well, we're, we're rolling with it. Huh. In that case, it's my pleasure to be one of the first people for you to meet in Vierne. Or at least, if you arrived recently and if you have a decent impression of me. If you didn't, then... I guess you won't have a very good time here. Don't worry, it was really nice to meet you and stuff. Also, you're the second person we've met in Vyarn. Really? I'm glad to hear that. In that case, the first person you met must have been... Ayas looks at the fainted girl and pauses. 
Well, that's just a singular case. I wouldn't worry too much about it. People in VR are as nice as they are anywhere else. Great. So it's terrible here too. Oh, okay. I'm sensing bad vibes. So I, I hope you enjoy your stay here, maybe? Oh, come on, Florin! <laughs> the frame rate's getting real bad. I probably need to stop. Eh, ha 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 ha. 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 Ha.